Hi guys, today I will be showing you how to make camarones a la diabla or devil shrimp. Today is going to be a little bit of a different video because my husband is going to make them and I'm going to film him. Uh, the kitchen wasn't lighted properly but because it's already 10 p.m. at night but still gonna post the video uh, if you guys would like to know how I make or how my husband makes devil shrimp just keep on watching what are you doing first babe I'm dropping stuff first no getting the ingredients mm -hmm. I got butter. okay so what do you need about that much butter okay butter and I added this kind of butter garlic butter and regular butter yeah, and then some pepper. Garlic butter. Pepper, whatever you want. Some garlic butter and some regular butter. And he put it in that. And then he's putting, he already put some pepper, pepper. in there. And uh, now. One clove of garlic. And he's going to chop garlic. So garlic, así comido, like entero, it's really good for you. Mm -hmm. It helps with a lot of stuff. But it's really spicy if you just chew it. Do it, do it. I don't know how to do it. You want me to do it? No, I know how to do it. Let me do it. You film me though. It's okay. I have. Okay. That's good enough. Okay, now add it to the mixture. Now he's going to put it in the microwave so it can melt. Okay, so it has melted a little bit in the microwave. Now what he's going to do is add the juice of a whole lemon. You add the juice of a whole lemon. And then he's going to put some ketchup. No, it's okay. I just put to taste. Oh, about that much. About that much of ketchup. Maybe half a cup or so. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna put um, chipotle, chipotle sauce. This one has the whole chipotles in there. Chipotle peppers in adobo sauce. So he's just gonna dump the whole container. This container is a seven ounce container. It's one of the small ones. So dump it all in there. Dump it all in there. And he's also going to add this. This is Hugo Maggi. Hugo Maggi, some seasoning sauce. Espérate. Go. Going to add a 
a spoonful. Mm -hmm. Okay, a whole spoonful. Now he's gonna mix it around. Mix it like nobody's business. Mix it really, really well. Now we're going to put simmer it in a pan. Just leave it in the pan there to simmer. Then I'll put the shrimp in. Now you add the shrimp. It's about a pound of shrimp. Frozen. And it's pretty frozen. Just cover it and it'll open. Mm -hmm. Let it simmer there for a long time. <laughs> he said to let it simmer covered for a long time. So we'll see. It's 9.40 right now. We'll see how long this takes because the shrimp is frozen. It shouldn't, doesn't supposed to be frozen, but we just bought it and it was frozen, so. We're going to wait a little bit and then I'll show you what you do next. Okay. When you put the shrimp in, it's going to get watery like this. You just put if it it's frozen. When, you know, when it's, yeah, it's frozen. I drizzled a little bit of olive oil. Keep it in low and just... Stir it every now and then until it gets thick. It's gonna thicken up. Thicken up. Right now it's not thick enough, so we're gonna let it simmer for a little longer and then we'll show you the end result. Yeah. So the shrimp is done right about now. Let it, it thicken more if you want. Yeah, you can let it thicken a little more, but we are hungry, so we're going to eat it like this. I'm going to plate it and show you guys how it looks. So this is the end result. This is how Camarones a la Diabla or Devil Shrimp is. It's pretty delicious. Well guys, that is how my husband makes devil shrimp. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day. Bye guys.